Aloha y'all, Kathy Boshuti here with Angel. This is my little sidekick and some of you guys might be watching just for her. You think they're watching for you? They're probably watching for you. Anyway, I am your new breast friend and I am wearing a cami holding a duck. What is a cami? A cami is your bra replacement. And how do you get one of these? Well, first you would uh, get with me and you're gonna fill out something called a Fit Finder on my website. And you'll see those numbers up there. You'll see that depending on when you're seeing it, there'll be a different video, but you'll see Fit Finder. We're going to want you to fill that out and going to show you how to take measurements in just a moment. And we're going to want to learn, you know, like what kind of bra replacement do you want? Do you want something that's more traditional like a bra, except for no hooks on the back? And this is a plus for a couple reasons. And I'm going to share that uh, throughout this, this time together. So the Demi Et is the little sister to the Cami. The Cami is a camisole that comes down longer and on some of them, it can help hide your fluff. So I'm not hiding as much fluff with the size that I'm wearing versus if I actually wore more of my suggested size. So this is actually a 42, but I'm gonna show you how crazy this is, right? It, it's working, it's working, but I have a large a band to bust ratio. And how do I know? Well, I got a measuring tape. We wanna get an idea, and these will fit multiple sizes. Obviously, I'm wearing a 42, but if I take my measurement, and this one, again, that's parallel where the bra uh, band would go. And for me, that's around a 35. And bring it up and we're gonna come across not wearing a padded bra or a minimizer. And for me, that's around a 49. Now, if I brought it into the center, that's gonna measure like more of a 46 and a half. And sometimes that can make a difference depending on where you're at. So if you're, you're near that seven inch difference and stuff, you may need to size up. Now you won't size up quite to a 42 from say like a 36, right? <laughs> it's, it's not that crazy. I can wear a 36. The 36, what happens with me in a 36 or 38, I have a little bit more spillage, but even with this 42, when I first put it on, I have some of that. And there's a couple of tricks that I do. One, I stretch the cups. Once I decide, I like how it fits everywhere and I get my straps adjusted. Now, what is this weird thing on here? This is not Ruby Ribbon. If you're a heavier chested girl, I'm gonna recommend it that or doubling up. And I'm gonna show you doubling up as well. But there's different tricks that I do to be able to fit into these. And these are most expensive one is a pocket cami that doesn't have fluff control, but it's got a pocket on the right hand side. It's really cool, it goes from size 32 band. So if you're smaller than that, you can wear it all the way up to 50. And these have give to them. So if you're larger than a 50 band, depending on the rest of your measurements, you may be able to fit a 50. So on some of the styles, once you kind of get past the 40 somethings, you may get a little bit more material. So there's different things that you can do. And how you see it spilling on me or like lots of cleavage. If you're a B or C cup, you're not gonna get that. You're gonna get separation and you're gonna probably be like, you know, like up in here. For me, I would have to get those straps up. Again, this is a 42, so a little bit bigger than what's recommended for me, or I can double up. And what I mean by double up is these have no underwires. So they're actually pretty comfortable. And check this out. I, my duck can fit into the cup area. And so my demiat, right? So it, these take up less room. I, I don't need padding. So if you had padded bras, that's gonna take up more. So you can get more camis and less space. And you'll be able to reshop your closet. I know there's a lot of things for me that were in timeout, such as this shirt. This shirt is very clingy. And uh, let me put it on and show you. Okay, I pulled my hair up and put our little March release scarf on here as well. Anyway, look how smooth this is. And in the back, I would never get that with my bra. You wanna see? Okay, so first of all, I have this fluff here, and then you can see the details of the bra. And yuck, that's just not fun. And it's uncomfortable. I haven't even had this thing on two minutes, and I'm ready to like take it off. So, Okay, Hang on. So if you're doing this, you definitely, definitely need Ruby Ribbon. So we got that lift and these girls, sorry about the headlights. Yeah, <laughs> they sit at about my waist. So I do get lift with these camis and the demiats and there's no underwires. And you want to see the difference again? I'm going to put on this one here. This is a demiat. It is a level five. It does have, can you see this right up in here? So that has some support, but again, it's, it's nothing uncomfortable at all. So you can put it on over your head or you can step into these. This is how I would suggest doing it the first time. And I flip up that, um, that band on the bottom. So it's not, anyway, I'm just gonna get it up, hang on. Okay, <laughs> see the difference? They're not at my waist anymore. And it's smooth here, you know, here, but 
I'm gonna have that and I'm gonna have this with the Demiette. This is what the Demiette looks like, okay? At least on me, most women, they're gonna have the girls in their separate pockets, but there's a lot of real estate on this little frame. The thing I love about this Ultimate is it has the two layers that are thin, so if I need to stretch that cuff, I can do it separately. And then you can see, again, you have that. It's not on the level fours, this part. But on the level four, you're gonna have both of these. You're just not gonna have access to, to each layer. And most women, right, so you have that, that's a little softer, that's got the gripper. You put it here, and then you're gonna move around. And I promise you, it's gonna flip, okay? So that might drive you nuts. Here's the solution. If you take that, don't have it like that. You see it on the model reality is tuck it up underneath there right and then if it does flip it's really not a big deal because this as a demiette should be kind of your little secret when we're working on focusing on going from size 32 band all the way up to 50 in our different styles so i hope you learned a little something and if you have any questions please let me know again filling out this fit binder helps so if you do fill that out could you please screenshot your results and also send me your measurements that way number one i know if i'm getting it and number two if you let me know prior to to purchasing what you're interested in if you're brand new i have uh, coupon codes that you can use if your order is hundred dollars or more we normally want you to have two or more and the reason is you're not going to want to you're not going to want to take it off so you're going to want to wear it the next day but you need to let it rest 24 hours just like a pair of shoes you know you really are supposed to let them breathe a day okay and then most women will start with two and then build up you might like font colors or maybe you're somebody who likes the neutrals not me because guess what this is pretty much the only color that i had to choose from from all my my selections when i i could find a bra even when i went in just to double check to see if i was really at 36 n and i was um this is the only color and it was hard to tell which bra was which it was all stitching and it all had crazy stitching like this now having the proper size the band did come here now do note this ours are different okay see how high up they come so what that's also doing is it's helping to support your girls because you want the band of your your support system to be doing most of the work not your your shoulder straps so again do you want something this then or do you want something like this or are you like me and you need to cover some some fluff and you need that back support so this is what the back support looks like on most of our level four and our level five camis with the angel wing compression again not to be confused with angel the duck and our original has a crisscross design that's the only cami that we have right now going forward that does not have these convertible straps which means that you can take them off and crisscross them so when you do it gives you more lift and support on the demiettes they're permanent um it's it's pretty cool though and for me i can double up wearing a cami and a demi they give me a little extra lift or as i showed you the strap savers again this is not ruby ribbon you can get it on the strapsaver.com uh, also on amazon and for me it's a game changer it helps shorten the strap so i get that because i'm short here but i have friends who they're really long and they need it all the way back so everybody is going to have different things that work for them they don't if your shoulders dig into you there's uh, something i found on on amazon as well it is a shoulder discomfort thing you put it up over in here and it helps kind of redistribute the weight so again i don't know if you know this but there's a, a little chart thing and it so you can google it i'm at 36 in right a 14 inch difference that's 110 pounds of force pressure on my spine. And I was always wondering why my doctor was asking me, does my back hurt? But since I switched the camis, it gives me the right support. Now on levels two and three, that's our second skin for level two. It doesn't work for me. It's my lounging, it's my sleeping. It is kind of being sexy and just being soft or layered um, in la level three, except for the Simply Smooth cami or Simply Smooth Pocket cami. But that doesn't have the back support that I need, but it does have the sling that is also found on this one but it does not have any of that extra shapewear it's basically two layers like this so there's different reasons why we have the different ones why they're priced the way that they are um, i personally have had to spend well over a hundred dollars most of you who are watching probably maybe 50 75 dollars might have been what was a expensive bra for you but again, depending on what you're getting, our most expensive demiette currently is 79, and that's actually a sports demiette. So we do have a sports demiette, and um, and it goes down to 62. Anyway, but not every level has 
all the design features and on our camis um, with the, the support that I need they go 84 on up but we do have some that are 75 and then we have one I think the second skin might be like uh, 72. Again, it's your camisole, it's your bra replacement, and in most of them, they're your shapewear. And on even the level three, it can have a light smoothing effect, and you're not going to have that, that icky back bulge. <laughs> Definitely worth the money to me.